Quickly, before you watch the video, guys, I'm dropping my first ever music project. There's 10 songs. It's called Statement Piece, and it will be out April 3rd. What I need you guys to do, if you have not already, which a lot of you guys already have, so shout out to you guys. There's a link at the very top of the description. Click on that link. Pre-save the project. The more people that pre-save it, it helps me get on like playlists and all that stuff, so I would really appreciate if you guys show some love and click the link at the top of the description. Pre-save the project. As soon as the songs drop on April 3rd, stream the hell out of them. Support your boy. I love you guys so much. Enjoy the video. Let's get it, baby. All right, guys, times are tough right now. I gotta be honest. And there's multiple jobs that I have being an influencer, rapper, underwear model, all these things. Like, there's certain responsibilities that I have and I need to tell you to do. First responsibility being stay, the at, your home. stay at your goddamn house, okay? You're not cool posting snaps outside. We don't wanna see that shit, bro. We're trying to end this shit. And you know what I'm talking about. I'm not even gonna say the word because it's zook. But if you're outside, I think you go home. Okay, first thing that I need to say, social distancing. Second thing, I'm here to save your guys' lives. I'm here to make your lives easier. And today we're doing life hacks, but not only just regular life hacks. These are life hacks that, let's say you couldn't go to the grocery store in time to go get your toilet paper or your paper towel. I planned way in advance because I knew this shit was going to be crazy. And I've been staying at home for the past couple weeks and it's boring. But I can show you guys how to get by. Let's say you couldn't go and get a mask. Let's say you couldn't do this, this, this. I'm going to help you today, okay? So smash the like button and I vow to drop videos on your head top so at least a couple minutes in your day can be lit every single fucking day or every second day whenever I drop videos during this sh time. But I'm still dropping videos so smash the like button if you want to see more wavy videos on board in my house and I have nothing better to do. And uh, let's get into the first life hack. By the way, before I even do this life hack, I'm trying to show you guys all hacks that you can do in your house, okay? You don't need to leave your house or you shouldn't need to leave your house because hopefully all the supplies that I'm using today are supplies that will be in your house. So if you do not have a mask, I'm going to teach you how to do a DIY mask on your head top, okay? It's not no N95 regulation mask. But if you're staying inside, it's better than nothing, okay? Because you shouldn't be going outside anyway. So, you're gonna need a paper towel. You're gonna rip off two little rectangles of it, and we're not gonna do much to this. All you're gonna do is fold right here. As you guys can see, they're doing in the TikTok. We're gonna fold once like this. We're gonna fold back, and we're gonna keep flipping it. Flip, fold, flip. You know, that's how you make a paper plane. Fold. We're not making an old paper airplane today. By the way, guys, Geese filmed the video. Shout well, out Dr. Good. Hobbs. Shout out Dr. Hobbs. Shout out Ryan Swayze. We're all literally staying at home doing nothing. Swayze baby in the... <laughs> Get the hell out, get the hell out. This is no jokes, no jokes. Don't leave me in the building. Ryan's sick, oh. Social distancing, please stay away. Oh yeah, bro. We have to film. I need to film from here. Yo, bro. We're good, we've been in the same house together, so we're chilling. What up, guys? It's your boy Swayze, baby. I'll kill Swayze. So look, we're almost done the folding process now. One more like so, just like this. Now, can you distance? Oh, sorry, Please? sorry, sorry. Yeah, I'll try, I'll try. Go on. Now we're gonna grab our mini stapler. This is the only stapler I could find in my crib, and I didn't want to go to the store to buy a new one. And we're gonna grab an elastic. So now we're gonna put the elastic like this. You know what that is? You know when you're too hot and you want a a rubber band? It's called a fan. A, it fan, like a fan. A fan. Yeah, that's what yeah, I'm yeah, going to And we're gonna staple the elastic onto the paper like so. Boom. Oh. One staple on like that, and the same with an elastic band on the other side like this. I only have four staples in here, and I'm not going to the store to buy more so if I mess up we're over two staples as you guys can see what does this look like uh. a mask okay I said it's not no N95 we're gonna take one of these sides put it around our ear put the mask on my face a little big kind of wavy and other elastic boom <laughs> don't That's like talk to me nice it talk to banger. me nice <laughs> This is dirty. And see, look, I might be spitting out particles, but like I said, me, Ryan, and you have been in the house. We've been quarantining, bro. This is oh, quarantine. Yo. We've been doing life hacks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Holy hell. This is not the life first life. You crazy? He looks like a funny guy. Yo, 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 yo. Demonetization. <laughs> so yeah, we don't want to talk about Ryan, but yo, would I give this life hack a pass? Hell yeah, it looks bro, safe. Bro, that actually looks nice. It actually looks like it came from like Shoppers Drug Mart or any local like drugstore. Yeah. And uh, you know, it's comfy. Do you want to try it on my oh. same mask? Do you want to try it? No, I'm good. I'm good. Oh, okay. You, you want to try I'm not really good. I'm fine. Okay, okay. I'm so I'm going to give the first life hack for survival a pass. Next life hack. So I don't know about you guys, but personally, I planned in some areas for this apocalypse time. However, one thing that I never really bought because I'm just in general like a fucking clean person. I don't really buy hand sanitizer. I wash my hands with soap, but up until now, I haven't really been the person who overuses hand sanitizer, carries it with me. Like I'm not really too much of a germaphobe. So as you guys can see, this is my remainder of what I have. So I'm literally like splitting bottles, bro. 
I have a little bit of this one when I go in public, if I go buy groceries or whatever essentials, I'll use this one and then this. Like this is all that I have. One day I went to every store when I went to groceries looking for this. Shit. Couldn't find it anywhere. I know there's a lot of you guys that kind of played yourself like me. I'm gonna teach you how to make your own hand sanitizer and then compare it with the real Purell hand sanitizer and see if it's similar. Now, one thing that you guys should know, I don't know if you know this, alcohol fights bacteria. Vodka, you could literally use vodka to fight bacteria. That's you... why I am bacteria free, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. You have Cheers been. to Charlie. Yeah, yeah. We do not have bacteria in us because it is alcohol actually clears that. So yeah, it does. drink alcohol and you will have no bacteria. So I'm that's drunk. Holy I'm drunk. Yeah. Oh yeah. Anyway, <laughs> is that the main reason you've been drinking so much Dutchy drinks? Because it clears bacteria, right? You know, gotta stay clean. But that's the only reason, right? He's, he's clean. <laughs> bacteria right now. Congrats to Ryan. So I went to the store. They only use two things in the TikTok. One of them being literally alcohol, like rubbing alcohol. It has this, to be 99% though. If they didn't have 99%, it should be 99% because that cleans 99% of germs. Uh -huh. But if all they have at the store is 70%, still, you're that would do. it's a skin cleaner. Look, it says antiseptic skin cleaner. Soothing massage solution to relieve sprains, bruises. And so what, what are you doing? Yeah, yeah. Just to pour the alcohol? No, 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 no not oh, the real alcohol. Oh, 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 oh. I need that. I need that for later. So we have the rubbing alcohol. If you can find it at your store, 99%. You get that? Open that up. The other thing we're gonna need is aloe vera gel. If you don't know what aloe vera gel, it comes from like literally this fucking plant called aloe. I ate it once. Vera. I ate that plant once. You can actually eat the gel. gel that comes out of it. If you crack the leaf open, it's like this thick consistency. I don't know if it's 100% green, but when mm -hmm. you buy it from the store, it's green. So we're gonna take some aloe vera gel. This is gonna give us the nice consistency. As you guys can see, it already looks like hand sanitizer. I don't really measure on this channel, we just eyeball it. And now we're gonna grab the rubbing alcohol. So this is gonna start to dilute it. Put about that much in. Grab a spoon and like two words, mix. So now we're gonna mix the hell out of this. You can drink that, bro. How are you gonna put it on your hand? Do you drink hand no, sanitizer? But look how watery and saucy it is. Okay, so I was gonna put the rest of this yeah, in. Yeah, yeah. So are you are you done? We're grabbing the rest of the aloe. <laughs> You put I, alcohol. Yeah, I definitely put too much alcohol. Hey Ryan, you want to drink? Yeah, I'm down. No, no, no. Pour, pour it a little bit of this alcohol. Do not drink rubbing alcohol. Disclaimer, please don't drink it. Please never do that. Just keep mixing. Just keep mixing. So I'm going to do this for about a minute or so until this smoothens out. And like, I'll come back. So I've been mixing this for around two minutes or so. And now we have a nice smooth consistency. And yo, it's actually green hand sanitizer. Keep this. This is actually jello. very satisfying. So now we gotta try it on the hands. And if this works, bro, this might be the best hack of today because if you read what aloe vera gel does, what is everyone complaining about using hand sanitizer? Bro, my hands are dry, blah, blah, blah. Contains aloe vera, which has natural moisturizing properties to rehydrate skin, preventing dry and peeling or flaking. It's the hardest sentence you've ever read. Yeah, 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 I can't read that. I could it's not read It's the smallest that. text. It's the smallest text. No, no, I was, I was proud, I was proud. <laughs> Basically, it, it moisturizes your hands. So if this dries your hands out, this can cancels that and cleans it. Let's use this. Oh. Does it smell good? It smells like rubbing alcohol, which smells like hand sanitizer. Bro, already my hands feel very moist. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a little too moist because one of the things I like about hand sanitizer is that it dries pretty much if, it, if you rub it for like five seconds, go like one, two of these, it's dry. Now, as you guys can see with my hands, they are still a little <laughs> bit wet. Uh, I'm sure this will dry. You know what I mean? Maybe I used yeah, a, little a little too much. Too much. But my hands are now clean. My hands are now moist and my hands are getting all the germs off me. It's actually, it's no actually not bought. <laughs> I, it's actually not bought at all. I might put this in this bottle because this bottle is done. So I'm definitely saving this, putting this to the side, and then gonna fill up this bottle after. But yo, the back of my hand is completely dry. I'm giving this a nine out of 10. Smash the like button, guys. I'm teaching you how to save your goddamn life. Stay inside, please. Stay inside next time. Simple question I have for Ryan and everyone at home. What am I holding right now? You're holding a piece of paper with a, my net worth on it. A piece <laughs> of, I'm not, <laughs> okay, I was gonna say, I'm not editing shit on this paper. So these are nice little regular printer paper, okay? Mm -hmm. However, you're wrong because everyone that commented that, guess again, buddy, it's not paper, it's toilet paper. Ew. Because apparently you can use regular paper and turn it into toilet paper by folding it in half one time go like this okay now we're gonna rip it in half I don't know why the girl in the video does this but we're just testing it out rip it in half the fold did nothing to help me and now we're gonna crumple this together until this turns soft apparently no, after you no. crumple it a bunch it turns soft you have to use it Shadi not using that so I'll use it so what she did in the video is she crumpled it up like this and then she kept going like this this is like her technique she's like oh after you do this for a few minutes I don't know if the girl felt like the girl filming it it was her daughter so I don't know if she was trying to make a meme out of her mom but if this works yo shout out the mom so i'm gonna keep going like this for literally like a few minutes trying to make this paper toilet paper as soft as possible and i'll come back i'll let you guys know if it's truly soft enough to wipe your box high. so i've crumpled this paper for literally about five minutes now it's actually kind of feeling soft not too bad like it's not rough on my face or anything but the one thing is we need to do a true test so 
Follow me. Oh, follow I'm, me, guys. I'm about to see some great things. No, no, you can stay outside. I'm no, I'm, I'm, I'm down. No, no, I'm no, not stay saying, outside. I'm not. But yo, one second, guys. Just keep rolling the camera. I'll what? be back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you yeah, sure yeah. I can come in? And I'm going. I'm going. All right. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. How does it feel? Hold on. I'm going right now as we speak. Oh, yo. What? It actually worked. No. Yo! It actually I don't worked. See this, bro. Ew. <laughs> Ew, ew, ew. Are you crazy? What the hell is that? It's barbecue sauce. Oh. If you guys think I'm putting a piece of fucking paper on my bakas, my bakas are royalty. So you didn't even try it? I'm not gonna try this, but I will tell you, ew, it is kind it is kind of soft. But if you do this, I can't lie, you're weird. You're a little <laughs> weird, because I swear if you could afford pieces of printer paper, you can afford toilet paper. I'm giving this a two stars out of three bananas. Next time. Oh my god! Yeah, hey, what, 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 what? Bro, you didn't do it long enough while you were in there messing around. I kept going at it. Uh -huh. It takes just takes time. Oh my god! Bro, look how Ew. soft it gets, how you guys. Long did you go for it. For like ten more minutes. Look, look at this. Oh my Ooh. god! Oh my god! It's actually like three ply toilet paper, like this. Sh it's sitting right here. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! It doesn't work next time. <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's bad, that's bad. Bro, what are you doing? Watch oh, that Oh my, oh my god. god. This guy ate food earlier and didn't even wash his phone before using it. Guys, I'm gonna show you how to wash your phone properly. Why is your thumb up? Let's get it. <laughs> Obviously, as everyone is quarantining and we're chilling at home, there's literally like not a whole lot to do, okay? I'm filming, I'm playing Fortnite, making music. I'm on my phone for a large amount of the day. And one thing that I can teach you guys is how to clean your phone the proper way because you don't know how many germs are on your phone. So the first thing I'm doing, I'm gonna take off a case of Ryan's phone. Now, I'm gonna grab any empty plastic bottle. Literally, you can use any bottle. We are going to fill up this bottle half with water, not even the full way. And then we're gonna do the rest of this rubbing alcohol because this rubbing alcohol is the cleaner, but we don't want it to be too much rubbing alcohol in here. So now just like that, we have half and half, half water, half rubbing alcohol. Now what we're gonna do, shake, shake, shake it up. As you guys can see the bubbles. How do you see the cleaning vibes? Are you crazy? And we're gonna take any cloth. The girl in the video used the microfiber cloth. If you don't know what that is, they just hold bare liquid. This one's, I think it might be a ShamWow ripoff. I had it in my closet for time. Holds more than five times its weight in liquid. All right, sick. So we have the cloth. You can also use paper towel, whatever you have at your crib, so you don't have to leave your crib. We're gonna take the staples out of here because I don't want to Scratch my phone. Why would they staple this shit, bro? Ow, that are fucking little piece of shit. Yeah. <laughs> okay, guys, so now we have the little handy shammy. We are going to grab our disinfecting DIY spray. We don't want to spray too much on it, and luckily, the new iPhones are waterproof, so. Just a little bit on, on the, the camera front. like that. A little bit on the front, a little bit on the back. I want to clean everything. And we are just going to give this circular motion rub downs like the girl on the TikTok did because we want to clean not only the back, but we want to clean the front. We want to clean the top, the sides, everything on your phone. And you can do the same with the case because the case is dirty. The case is actually on the outside. But this one, we don't need to be as careful because it doesn't have any electronics. Same type of thing, rub down, DIY cleaning spray. All you need is rubbing alcohol, not even soap, bro. Rubbing alcohol and water and a liquid bottle. And you're good. Like, that's good. It smells clean to me. Next hack. All right, guys. So for this next hack, <laughs> this one I gotta be a little bit sneaky because I don't know if uh, Sylvia's gonna approve of this one. So this one we're going in the closet. Sylvia's got a bunch of her clothes on this side. She has a lot of her clothes in LA. But like, there's one thing I need. This stuff. I can't even believe this is actually a real oh. TikTok life hack. But <laughs> your boy has like a bra. Yeah, you guys. Watch out, bra. Yeah, yeah, chill, 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 chill. chill. It's Sylvia. Yo, so oh, weird. Oh, oh. <laughs> It's, okay, it's definitely not Sylvia's. I had to go to the store and I had to buy the biggest bra I could find because I have a big face, okay? I have a big head. Sylvia's a small girl. She doesn't have triple, duple, 37 Ds. No yeah, padding. they're massive. They're the biggest. Can you guys stop touching shit? I've never seen wow, I've never, like, we never had some business seen We don't have it before. Yeah, Bro, time with it. yeah stop. Know you don't know how to work with that? I don't really Yeah, yeah, well, really wash your goddamn hands before you start. I'm gonna make you a mask bra. with the bra, give me that. I'm gonna teach you guys how to make an actual mask with this bra. Like I said, guys, I had to go to Walmart and buy a bra because I had to get a big one. <laughs> Here we go. So the first step, flip the bra over like this. Found the cheapest one so I could just ruin it. We're gonna cut the middle. This is cringe for all the women viewers or men, men or men or whatever you, you know. I consider that kind of hot. Classify yourself at what, cutting it? Cutting up a bra, it's like. I am, I'm prefer like biting it off my teeth. Holy smokes. <laughs> but we don't want to talk about any of that right now, you know what I mean? <laughs> Never seen that before. Never done that. <laughs> Holy no, smokes. We're not going to go. We're not going to do it with one hand. No, because I haven't been, you know, with a lot of women like you. No, what? <laughs> like me? <laughs> That's very wrong. Me, I like, I struggle. I'm like, free I'm the like, bra, free the How bra. do you even work with this thing? Oh, shit. How do you even work this thing? I don't know. I just came undone, but undo the bra. And now, <laughs> yeah, eh? we are going to cut off this side as well. That's hot, bro. Are you done? 
No, it's on the phone. Watch it out. <laughs> Being a cock <laughs> in the corner, bro. It's a weird one. And uh, we're going to take this off as well. I hate to do this, ladies, but you got to do what you got to do. Are you done? I'm not doing anything. Right. Stop, bro. Yeah, like, yeah, I'm not yeah, looking. Yeah. And now, last but not least, we're going to see if it fits the face. Whoa, it actually fits your face. Fits your face nice. Does it smell good? Are you? He face bought it new, bro. Oh, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Bro, Bro, the unused bra from Walmart, you weird I think one. bras actually do have sense, some of them. Yeah. Yeah, when women wear them. No? No, it comes with Savage Fenty has one. When I was in the friggin' store trying to buy this from Walmart, all I seen is Guy in the, in the other corner, like this. What? <laughs> and he was <laughs> saying some random girl's name. Holy I, won't go, I won't go there. I've never done that, Anyways, ever. We're gonna grab super glue, and we are gonna glue this little area. Bro, that should be a prank. Super gluing my girl's broader chest. That is definitely abuse, but you know, go ahead. Now we're gonna hold that for around a minute, let it bond. This is the smallest one I have ever seen in my life. Oh my god. <laughs> See, CPMs are low odds right now, bro. <laughs> Charlie, oh, Charlie would have bought 10 of them. Like I said, guys, these are all hats. Shut the Wolfie! These are all hacks that you can do with everything you have in your house already. My majority of this was in my house. So now I have two bra, uh, two, two masks. I made two masks. So we're gonna see if the super glue works. If it doesn't work though, realistically, you could use tape, you could use a stapler, whatever works. First mask right here. And like I said, guys, I have a big head, but this is stretchy for 34D boobs. You know the vibes? Boobs. <laughs> boobs. I haven't heard that word in so long. No. I don't know what to say with Take off your hat, bro. It's yeah, okay. You know, we're going through, everyone's going through some shit. We miss our barbers. Oh, shit. This is hot. Oh, shit. You guys already see the vibes? That's a the bra mask vibe. That's, that's a vibe. This is vibe. Not bad. It's a little tight on me still. <laughs> okay, so there's this one. And let's try the other side to make sure both sides of the bra are indeed working. Oh my god. Bro, bro. There's spiders on your head, my bad. There's a spider. You think you're funny, eh? <laughs> you Beat this, guys. The this is what we call a bra mask. Just like that. <laughs> Nothing on you because the mask stops. It looks very comfortable. This hack actually works and is extremely comfortable because of the material of the bra. So I'll give this a pass. And Guy, I'll give you the bra. You weirdo. Next hack. If you have been going to the grocery stores or whatever, Walmarts or whatever, and you have not found any disinfecting wipe, it's all good. I'm gonna show you how to make your own. This is super easy. Everybody at the stores is going straight for the Lysol wipe, straight for the Purell, but they're leaving certain products at the stores. Like they're leaving Shout and they're leaving this all purpose everyday cleaner. So these two things are just in general cleaner. They clean everything counters you can you know, you can use them to wipe things down like a microwave whatever you want So we're gonna grab a few of these paper towels each paper towel is going to be pretty much a disinfecting wipe And one of these we're gonna spray with the shout just to see the difference if there is any difference Spray it a bunch like this You're also gonna grab a ziploc bag like this and me and Sylvia actually did this hack We usually do this whenever we travel with the dogs because the dogs piss and all that shit and want to disinfect stuff So we always keep a ziploc bag of wipes in our bags and just like this guys fold this in half We're gonna grab the Ziploc bag, put this in here. We're gonna do the same thing, except with this all-purpose cleaner to see if there's literally any difference. I don't think there's gonna be any difference other than the smell. Boom, boom, boom. Make sure everything's nice and soaked. Fold it up. We're going to put it into this bag. Boom. So now we have the shout bag. We have the other bag. So let's just say, for example, we wanted to test out how clean they were. As you guys can see, I have some duttiness on the microwave. And when you have something that's not wet, you can try and wipe it down. But like, what are you really getting? Put that to the side, grab one of the bags, and we're gonna actually test out the cleaner. It feels like a Lysol wipe. It looks like a paper towel, but this has nice movement just like that. And look, we're gonna wipe, clean this down, clean the handle down. It smells wavy. It smells better than Lysol wipes, low key. And already we're getting some yellow stains, which is kind of nasty to look at. It's doing its job. Okay, it's cleaning. What? Is this counter need cleaning clean up the entire counter just like that and look it still hasn't ripped this paper towel is nice material thick enough just like Lysol wipes now we're gonna test out the other one literally same thing I haven't wiped down my MacBook in a while I've been too focused on my phone us bear people put their hands on this when I show people my laptop and stuff like that duttiness okay we're getting it all off and smells delicious so all you need Ziploc bag all-purpose cleaner shout whatever you want and paper towels if you can find them hopefully you can find them. if not you're gonna have to do that paper trick crumple the paper up and then put the spray on no. we only have a few more hacks to do this one I completely think is a little bit ridiculous let's say you're still required to work you work at a mandatory job and you have to go to the office and your office has like an elevator or whatever or if you are just a germaphobe which right now you should be a germaphobe this one requires a hanger just the top of a hanger a lighter and probably some tape or some glue so we're gonna try and replicate this TikTok to the best of our abilities by cutting this hanger off definitely easy to cut this metal bend it a bunch you know what I mean just like break this off 
Oh, there we go. Okay, so we've done that now. Now we have to bend this even more, the end of the uh, hanger. And what they do in the TikTok is they have like a nice piece of metal that dad made this that is permanently at the end of the lighter. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab some duct tape. I'm gonna do this for the purpose of, I don't really care what I use as the uh, thing that makes it stick on there because I'm probably not gonna use this. But who knows, there's a lot of life hacks that I do doubt. And then when I actually try them, I'm like, yo, this is actually kind of wavy. So we're gonna have this on the end, like so, perfect fit. And now grab some duct tape around here, right below where the fire comes out because you don't want to where the fire comes out, otherwise it'll melt. Tight as you can, if you can wrap it around here, like so. We're gonna do a few different times around the edge just so it's super strong and on there. Now that we've done that a bunch, this is sturdy. Look, I can push stuff with this metal. You know, I can move stuff with this metal. And the key thing about the metal is that it's not bending. So now let's say you're going to work. This is the elevator button. Boom, 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 boom. Press the button without your hand touching it. Don't let anyone touch your lighter, obviously, and give your lighter regular cleans. But the key thing about this life hack is not only does rubbing alcohol clean stuff, but fun fact, fire is a disinfectant as well. So push the elevator button, push whatever you need to do. You know what I mean? If you need to turn the sink on, keep this. You're turning the sink on at work and like disinfect the metal just like so. Boom, like that, turn it off, disinfect. I need Purell, come here. Take that, there you go buddy, disinfect. And onward, okay, life hack, this one actually works. Low key, gonna keep this. Uh, last life hack of the day, let's get it. The last hack of the day, this one is crazy. This one I'm super surprised about, but this one is so low key that there's not even that many crazy TikToks out there with this one. So this one's exclusive footage. Okay, so as you guys can see, in the bathroom, this toilet paper is empty. I'm gonna teach you how to make toilet paper from thin air. <laughs> So come with me, this one's very simple. What we're gonna do is a couple different steps. So follow me over here. We're on our Tooth Fairy vibes with this one. Guys, when you're a kid and uh, the Tooth Fairy used to come to your house all the time, you would never see the Tooth Fairy, but there would always be money under your pillow, okay? This is kind of a similar concept. So what we're gonna do is take the empty toilet paper roll, put it under this pillow like that. Now we're gonna go over here in my kitchen. The steps begin like this. You're gonna go on your laptop or if you're on your phone, it works on your phone too. You're gonna go to my channel right here, okay? You're gonna click the massive subscribe button on the side right here. Boom, once you click that I'm not signed into anything but subscribe you're gonna click the bell to turn on post notifications okay those are the first two steps now there's only two more steps to go the next step is you're gonna go to the top of the description in this video okay my EP is about to drop in a few days you are going to click on the pre-save link guys I know a lot of you are at home thinking no oh, this is this guy's crazy this is a joke no you need this works okay I, I'm gonna prove to you that this works okay this one's glossy just trust me you <laughs> wait till we see the results after you pre save the EP coming out April 3rd obviously you are going to go to your fridge knock on it three times and say toilet paper gods please supply me with the toilet paper I need for the rest of this month or many months however long this continues please 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 you don't need to say it exactly like that however you want to say it but just call it toilet paper god and now let's go check on the toilet paper follow me guys let's pray to God the toilet paper god specifically and ah, oh my god like yo look what he gave me oh my a god a full roll so on that Ooh. note guys you already know what to do follow all those steps and it'll work i'm just trying to keep everybody positive and have something to do well uh the, the stressful times are here and yo stay inside like i said at the start of the video stay inside if you don't need to go outside don't go outside talk up on toilet paper and all that stuff smash the like button i'll give away some of this because <laughs> this bear over here i love you guys so much been in boy wolfie aka charles i'm more wolfie where we stay a little more shout out to my mate charles and as always peace